gets a position back into the team this week. Todd Viney's given him the chance. McKenzie. Selwood. McGinnity. And he pumps it to half forward. It wasn't rushed through, so it's still alive. Padded hard. McGinnity just as hard. It's a chaos situation. About 25 players around the ball. Good spot for a ball up for Melbourne, though. Too far out for the West Coast to try and rush it behind. Well, I don't mind Colin Garland backing himself in with skill, but you can... Why? Oh, sorry, Danny. No, I just had a look at the, the Eagles forward line there, Dwayne. It was amazing. You had Kennedy, Lynch, Darling, just super tall down the middle. Kerr wide, three to beat, takes the mark. Good to see Kennedy back after the eye injury. I've seen them, boys. It's costing them their spirit and their want mm. to run. They're just not being rewarded at the moment. The Melbourne half forwards, and they're just they're becoming stagnant now. Key, do they roll the dice and just put Jamar down there? I know he's got his hands full with Cox and Nat Nui, but they need a strong target. They do, and I think their half forwards need to make themselves more dangerous because the West Coast half backs are just queuing up for possession at the moment. Well, the, the, the second quarter last week for Melbourne was deplorable against Carlton. This is a car. Carbon copy, Dwayne, because the inside 50s are 12 to 3 this quarter. Eight scoring shots to one. McGinnity. And here they go again. Embley. Maybe just beyond his range, but he smothered. Petted. Frawley to the wing. They've got the numbers, the West Coast. McKenzie makes a contest, the gives a free away. Here. Hearn to the middle to Gaff. It's as if they got all 22 out there. McGinnity back to Gaff. Melbourne flooding players back. Forces him to go back to Plenty of time left for Melbourne to fight back. They're trying to do that before they go in at halftime. McGinnity and Dunn. Not the time to be doing it. Ruffling a few feathers. Lyndon Dunn still going in hard. McGinnity attacking him with the nouns and verbs. They get split a little, pet it. Add some advice. Some heat in the kitchen. Probably good for the contest right now for the Demons to go in thinking we've had our feathers ruffled. We're not going to give this one in without a fight. West Coast lead, 47 points the margin at halftime. 10-9-69 to 3-4. 22. Into September. Both teams without their captains today. Brad Green not fronting up for Melbourne. And Darren Glass not there for the West Coast. And somebody not needs... Good side, Melbourne. Not good news for West Coast. It's an important player, Shuey. Hams to McGinnity. Did that impact the Rising Star, boys? Might too. Might. Blind ball. Kennedy, Frawley.